Tell us a little bit about you know working with students and trainees and and do you do you have a formula is there a special recipe for building successful young scientists uh, i don't have a recipe but i was not a very successful young scientist when i started i told you i started late i was uh, already a clinician and it was very humbling because uh, not everything was working i remember uh, the, the technician in John Dowling's laboratory at Harvard, she was telling me the expert is the one that has done all the mistakes. So you have gone very close to that because <laughs> I've done, I did so many mistakes. So, so I, I used to, to tell them that I've not always been very successful. Right. And uh, that uh, remi- remembering that we have no choice but trying to do the best we can is an important thing, not giving up. And uh, I and something like actually my one of my sons is jokes about this because something I say very often. The difference between success and failure is like 15 more minutes. You decided to give it another chance. You didn't stop there because it didn't work. Oh, you say good, I'm yeah. going to try again. Yeah. And uh, and well, like Beckett was saying, uh, failing, fail again, fail better. Just fail trying better. to to try to fail better.